Lines over some shit. Somebody always fucks up my name. Adds extra letters. A L D O. One, two, three, four. I don't know why they want to fuck it up, but they just do. They add on extra letters. You know what I'm saying? But uh, but either way it goes, they want to shorten it too. Not only do they fuck it up, they just call me Al. And my name was Timothy, but Jonathan. I understand that. But uh. Y'all gotta excuse me too, I got the jitters. This is like my first time up here, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> but uh but you know, if you got a fucked up name, you understand where I'm coming from. I'm pretty sure there's a couple of people in here with some fucked up names too. Especially one y'all know, Leventor back there. You know? <laughs> Third eye blind going on this thing. <laughs> It's all good. Now, I got the name from my mom and dad from South America, you know, they're from Chile. If y'all, I'm pretty sure you know where it's at, because, you know, 4.0. But if, uh, but it ain't in Mexico. Just want to cut that out. People are like, South America? Oh, gotta be Mexico. No, it's not. But, uh, no, they don't eat chili beans over there either, you know what I'm saying? But we do eat tacos, so I see where the confusion's at. But, uh... But speaking of my parents, so, you know what I'm saying, my dad, he's the craziest guy ever, you know what I'm saying, he gives me such wonderful advice. When I was growing up, I was like 15, 16, or whatever, you know what I'm saying, he said, son, what are you doing, don't get a tattoo. I'm like, why not? Shit, you wanna rob a store? Shit, don't know who you are. So I fucked up. I fucked up. I didn't know. I didn't know how rebellious kids are and stuff, you know what I'm saying? I didn't know what's going on. So I was like, fuck it, I got a homemade tattoo on my leg. But marijuana leaves, like, yeah, I'm smoking weed forever. Yeah, fuck yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I'm over there eating cereal and shit in my boxes. My brother, you know what I'm saying? That motherfucker right there. He's like, damn, damn, whatever you doing, don't look at his leg. Oh, what? Oh, god damn, son, now you can't wear shorts when you're out that fucking store. <laughs> oh, god, I love my dad, though. You know what I'm saying? So next thing you know, you get this shit on your arm and you fuck it all up, you know? I'm like, all right, man. I'm never gonna have it bad like that. But I quit smoking weed, even though I hate it and I loved it. Mary Jane. But uh, I joined the military, been in for like seven years now, in the Army National Guard. Poor. To all my military buddies out there. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. I helped out Katrina and, you know, two years of Homeland Security. That's where I met all my homies and shit. But, uh, but it was all good and gravy. We did a lot of video game playing and watched a lot of bootleg DVDs. Yeah! Yeah! That's right. High score Halo 2. Kill everybody. Get out the car. Next. Especially it was awesome when it's raining outside. <laughs> but anyways, you know what I'm saying? I got to uh... We sure do. We sure do. No, but, uh, but like I was saying, though, you know what I'm saying? Dealing with the military, you got a whole bunch of yokels in the military. Arkansas National Guard, I love them to death. But we got to yeah, yoke was like some inbred motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? For real, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie. They're, I'll die for them and I'll kill for them or whatever, you know what I'm saying? We wear the same colors, you know what I'm saying? We're the biggest gang in the world. So, you know, I do whatever I can, but you know, when they talk about hunting and fishing and shit, I don't know, this is Xbox game, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, you know, my homeboy there, I gotta bring him up. He's from Korea. J Hope Kim, the messed up name. That's right. That dude is crazy. You talking about military brainwashed motherfuckers? He is a prime example right there. He did for a little bit. He come up to a motherfucker and he be like, You wanna get the guard? Because he's from Korea, he got accidents. So you wanna get the guard? They were like, Nah, man, what the fuck is the guard? He said, You wanna wear a uniform just like me? I wanna see you in a uniform just like me. My first general order is, I'm like, What the fuck? I mean, he does this shit at parties and everything else, huh? General order, uh, I'm like, calm down, man. My oh. kid just turned five. They don't hear all that shit. The first mission is war. My first mission is war. I'm killed. Blood makes green grass grow. I'm like, no, man, calm that shit down. We're about to blow out the candles. <laughs> uh, that's that motherfucker. He's my homeboy, you know? He told me Sham Shum was uncle, that's my kids running around, but I don't speak Korean, so they probably call him an asshole. So if so, that's probably true. But you know, that's a, that's how it is, you know what I'm saying? We just tight like that. But uh I appreciate everybody, you know what I'm saying, laughing at my little feeble jokes. But I just uh, that's pretty much all I got and I just wanna let y'all know I appreciate all this. Y'all have a good time.